Welcome back to the channel, and I have to say, wow, thank you all so much for watching my last video. People spent over 12,000 minutes, that's 209 hours, watching for almost 4,000 views. If you didn't see it, I went to my dealership for a routine state inspection and fell in love with a 2018 Ford Performance Mustang Cobra Jet. I posed the question, was this car a GT500 killer, and a surprising number of people called me out, saying it's not a fair comparison. Well, it may not be comparing apples to apples, but it sure is fun seeing how far the Mustang platform can be taken. If you haven't already, check it out and let me know what you think about it. This week's video is dedicated to a much more average car out on some average adventures, my 2019 Mustang GT Convertible. If you're a car or motorcycle lover, and you suddenly get a window of beautiful weather in the middle of a dreary winter, you've got to get out for a ride. I've said this before, and I'll say it again. My Mustang GT has been a huge source of enjoyment for me, and these videos are my way of sharing the fun that I'm having with you. I haven't done a ride and chat in a while, so I am slapping on the GoPro and taking the Mustang out for a spin. Have I mentioned that you should get a Mustang convertible? What I hope to do on this channel is paint a picture of what it's like to own one of these cars. If I had to sum it up into two words, those two words would be, it's fun. This is one of my favorite parts. Let's go for a ride. I have to tell you, it is so nice out. It's a little bit cloudy couple of peaks of blue skies, but what's incredible is just how warm it is. It's a little bit breezy, but it's nice when it's a warm breeze. In January, one of the things I love about the convertible when the top is down is the visibility. It's just a very immersive experience. This is amazing. There's pretty girls out jogging in short shorts. In January, I know there's people in sunny western Florida right now going, eh, it's no big deal, but for me it is. It's just heartwarming to actually have my heart be warm. Gonna get me a nice drink of 93. out you need to start with three dollars worth of quarters even though it takes credit cards that's weird Check it out. Can you see my glasses? All right, let's see if we can find a place to towel off. I 
usually don't wash the roof with detergent, but I do like to give it a little drying because you don't want to put the top down while the top is wet. Well, note to self, make sure I replace the quarters in the car. And in today's day and age, you can just do a credit all the way. Step one. Step two. Step three. That is the sound of the car saying, thank you, Daddy. Hard to believe. I had to flex because there was a Camaro parked back there. So this is how the car sounds in Sport Plus. I really like the feel of this mode. I like the sound. I really can't imagine the car being much louder and you know not being totally obnoxious. But there's an appropriateness for a car to make a certain noise and I feel that it's totally appropriate for this car to be making this noise. In fact, I love the active exhaust that's in this 2019 Mustang GT convertible. If you'd like to know more about my opinions on the active exhaust, check out my video. I'll put a card right above. Even just driving respectably about the neighborhood, respecting the speed limit, it sounds really, really good. I love the pops and burbles when you let off of the gas. Ah, uh, road salt road salt. I just want to get home from the car wash without road salt. Just a tiny blip. A blip. That was the sound of automatic rev matching, a feature of the 2019 and 2020 Mustangs, which I quite enjoy. Well, thanks for coming for this little ride. My name's Mike, the channel is Mike Fixed It, and we try to bring you videos that tell you what it's like to own a sports car, specifically a Mustang GT convertible, but we've got lots of tips for all kinds of car ownership. So if you like this kind of video, please give it a thumbs up. Like the video, share the video, subscribe to the channel. Thank you so, so much for your time and for watching and for supporting the channel. Be good, be well, be safe, and I'll talk to you real soon. Bye-bye. I fixed it.